Let's take a quick look at the target. This one is actually not 4. This is 3. This one is number 4. They are from today. It doesn't look that bad except for this one. Right? So if I ignore the grouping is just like this and last target again if you ignore this the grouping is yeah not that bad somehow it seems like one out of five is I always do this and this is yesterday This looks slightly better because one, two, three, four, five. So basically everything's in the black circle. But the major difference is this one was clipped onto the parking sign, the metal sign. So this wasn't moving at all. These two, this box was hanging from the tree, flimsy tree branch and the wind was blowing. So it was constantly moving around. So, considering the fact that these targets were not still, I would say these are okay. Obviously, I have some problem. One out of five rounds always go somewhere completely off. I am trying to work on my grip and trigger pull. So hopefully this will improve as I improve myself. I have no complaint about the gun itself. And the size of the bad guys. This much grouping is perfectly adequate. I guess they, they would be both dead if I were shooting at them. And let me quickly show you about my range bag. I bought this from a friend of mine who runs Mac repair shop. He has a bunch of you know these things. So this is actually an old laptop bag by Targas. Back pocket holds target paper. Sharpie. Pellets. This holster actually falls flat, so it fits fine in here. And the slot is actually big enough so that you can run two ply gun belt through this loop. So I usually keep this in this bag. Don't always need them, but nice to have. And the main compartment. Pouch. This is actually a MTM ammo pouch. Target sticker. I usually don't use this one, but sometimes I just don't have enough time to set up the paper target. So And that's it. Actually, you can keep your pistol in here 
you know, these are nail planes, so it's not going to scratch your gun. And this is kept in here in case I have to spread the thing on top of my trunk lid. I don't have a trunk. That's it for my range bag. Hope it gives you some idea. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.